Hello! <laughs> it's November Fox, streaming a game for the first time. Well, if you're wondering what happened to the fight stick, that's a fun story. Basically, uh, when I was putting it together, it was nothing like my old PCB zero delay. You know, the zero delay PCB. Where I had the daisy chains and everything was easy. In this one, I had to remember to put the grounding wire in the grounding terminal. I also managed to bend one or two of the micro switches. So to make things easier on myself, I ordered cables. The brook cables. Uh, I'm also considering just using my old PCB, zero delay PCB, and taking the book PCB, and using that to create a hitbox while using the old zero delay to create a PC fight stick, since I already have two proprietary fight sticks for the Switch. One which I refitted with a octagonal gate. Anyway, that's the new plan for that, so that's going to take a little bit longer. In the description should be the link. In this case, I'm going to post a direct ticket link because I still have to get those tickets sold by the end of this week to pay for the MMA training. For those of you who don't know, I'm doing the Ultra Events White Collar for Cancer Research. But that's me getting sidetracked for the moment, although this probably will help. Either way, I decided I'd play some Lunacy with you guys. I would love to stream, but I can't stream till tomorrow. But anyway, I'll just uh, make a start. For those of you who don't know, Lunacy is in fact a yeah, controller isn't working, I had to plug that in and plug that out again, so I'll just default to keyboard and see if I can remember the controls. But Lunacid is basically a sort of... Well, it's based on a game much older than Dark Souls, King something series, and it's... Well, it's a one-man band that basically has made this game. Don't remember the name of the person either. <laughs> but I'm getting started anyway. In fact, that reminds me, I should really set timer on my phone. Don't want this to last too long. Well, we already wasted time as it is. set this to 40 minutes and I'll let you guys watch the opening video. I actually had this played on Proton when I was using a, a purely Linux system before I decided to just go down to dual to the debit. As you can see, the poison spewing drug anything. Long ago, a great beast that was a came really, really from the sea well. and brought with it a poisonous fog that spread across the earth. Corrupting everything it reached, the poison fog slowly transformed the, the world color of corruption and brought about purple. a new age. Now, grounded like by the poison West. sky and outnumbered by game. creatures, Humankind became desperate I've and formed that feudal kingdoms. Closed off from each other, they became paranoid and are on the brink of extinction. Those deemed undesirable, such as criminals or the ill, are cast out, banished into the depths of the Great Well, a pit of the diseased and undead. The Great Well is said to have but one door to the surface. So basically, just 
bash the Dark Souls series together with uh, Legend of Grimrock. Kingsglaive. That was it. I think it was. That's what the yeah. thing was based on was called. Good luck trying to find and play that. Might also consider playing Last Remnant with you guys at some point. Because that's not possible to really get now. But anyway. Go. I love the design of the moon, actually. Okay. I had, I just played as the, uh, what was it, yeah, Forsaken, yeah, Feast. Deciding than anything else.
I was tempted to just go witch, you know, you know, play with the lunacy system, but... You can pretty much go in any direction, no matter what you choose. Right. What's our equipment? Jack Dick Buggery. Said that. <laughs> oh well, five seconds and I'm already said root words. Controls, I remember. Yep, yeah. mouse was right, lock, space, shift, tap. I chose VHS as the thing. I'll stick with VHS. Yep. We are completely with nothing. That's not a big surprise. Inventory closed. Everything's accessed for the inventory. Just make sure nothing else is around. Believe it or not, I have played a save with this before, so. <laughs> where you need a key down that way, if I recall. Yep. So that means our first port of call is to go this way. Slumbering creature of moonlight, they're the last existing door. I don't think this game is completely yet, but I'm not certain on that. Okay. 
you don't know, that's a sort of bossy thing that shoots magic what's it. So let's not go pick on that yet. I just want to find myself some stuff and remember where the heck I'm going. I probably strayed completely off track. Ah, well that much I do remember. Do do do. me how to use my quick items. I'm going to have to figure that out myself. Excuse me. Oh, ah. Of course, it's not hostile. Way. Nothing there. So now we're going for a walk. Here. Let's see what's ahead of me. Okay. Going back down again, I'm assuming it's down in the direction. So we find it. Well, I'm not exactly saying anything that makes sense. Giant fleas. Um. <laughs> hmm. Oh, yep. Yeah. There's the VHS stutter. I think there was a coffin for something. For something. Yeah, there, there it is. There's the coffin. Ooh, flame spear. Let's check my stats, actually. Cast the second one. Ah, there's the character. And then we press D to use. And that opens the gate. Nice, nice, nice. Good, 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 good. They went in the right direction. Yay. Yeah, anime succubacy thing. What well, looks of it? It's got a heart shaped tail. Yep. That's what we need the with. Soon we shall go to the town where I shall have, as in tradition, a animal character to simp over. It's not her, by the way.
that's activated. Can I level up? No. Let's make sure of that. Yeah. Can't level up yet. Okay. You can tell it's used to playing Forsaken. Works. Last time I tried to spell it, it worked about halfway. I wonder what would have happened if I only got halfway. Or does she mean half of me halfway? Oh well. Cheryl! Cheryl the Crow! Loving the sound she makes though. I wonder how he recorded that. Was he using some kind of toy or something? Hmm. What do I have? Nothing for sale. Crossbow! Hmm, for my dex character I might want that. Oh, that I want. <laughs> Jointed key I want. Okay, crossbow will be our next point of port of call, I think. First, let's uh, add a mana vial. Mana vial. Crystal shard. Teleports them back. Enchanted key. Let's put the crystal shard in the end. switching items when I get to the door, I think. Yeah. Look at data, and then warp. Of course, back to here. In fact, do I go bully the snake? Or maybe the milk snail? Do I go bully it? Mmm, nah. Getting a conjure snail isn't that important. Not that I think Milk Snail provides me with Conjure Snail guaranteed. That's sort of a randomised thing, if I recall. There's the gate. So now we find the place where we need the key. Mm Don't get me wrong, I'm sure the milk snail was quite um, defeatable, but. Hmm. 
I know for the first time it does shoot a magic blue bolt. That could be rather annoying. <laughs> oh, and for those of you who don't know, if you do get the flame spear ring, trust me, you need this flame spear ring. <laughs> Because at some point you're going to be hitting things with torches and setting them on fire. There's undead in this game. Okay. This is where things get complicated. We must now remember how to use the items. That's the trouble. One major improvement they could make. You need a reminder on how to do your items. HP, ah, uh heart, -huh, man. Okay, got ya. So it's one after the other. One and two. One and three and two. Ah, uh, got ya. And press two. There we go. That helps. <laughs> Something they might want to include in the menu. They got the controller menu right, but they didn't um, explain everything about the keyboard. And of course, we're now getting to the point where I remember I said we'd need the torch. We're going to need a torch or magic. Ideally, I might want to save the flame sphere, but I'll just use the torch when things start getting dark. Things are about to start getting dark. <laughs> and there we go, going a lovely green colour, getting darker and darker and darker. Wait a minute, do I essentially have night vision anyway? Well, I suppose I could use ghost light, but do I even need it? I mean, this is way lighter than I was expecting. Ah. Well, anyway, I'll just go slay anyway. Because I need an excuse. Alright. And if worse comes to worse, I'll hit things with the torch. In fact, that's an idea. Let's... Why did I switch to the torch anyway? Why did I use the ghost light at all? Uh-uh. Yeah, something, if I recall, triggers them. Something I do. If you don't know, there's a ring in here at some point. And that ring allows you to transport your soul outside your body. It's also instant death if you try to use it. Prophet Abdul. You mean a nutty necromancer? Well, back to the torch anyway. Um, do we go down further or do we go up? I think I want to go down further. Oh, yeah. Of course, there's a lever somewhere, isn't there? Well. Not to use the ghost light. Let's cost me mana. Ah, ritual dagger. I mean, lovely as a ritual dagger is, a little sword is more effective. So you want to stick with it like a sword, which your dagger may have poison to it, but it's not much use against the undead. Oh joy, yep, yeah, this is where we get the ring of instantly kill myself. Um, okay. I mean, if you guys in the comments know, because there is some kind of trick with the ring from what I've heard, but... 
I do not want to transport myself into every anything and murder myself. Not without a save first. Yep, yeah, lithomancy. Transport myself into an object. Or resurrect an object or something like that. I mean, I'm sure I could use it at this, but I do not want to put my head outside my skull like that. I am not going to take that risk and go through all that again. So let's not. And this should be what triggers them. Okay. Okay. tell you is it gives life to the inanimate at the cost of your own brain. Rather, it probably drains so much HP. It is blood magic after all, so maybe that's the case. They just didn't have the HP to cover it. Ah, the poison. 
why is it stopped? Ah, poison doesn't last forever. Was that an update? Because last time I was poisoned, it was not pretty. and go save, I think. I think there's a way out of here. Or do I continue moving? No, I will go save before I make a fool of myself. I quite recall how the lunacy system fully works. Just check my phone quickly, see what my timer says. How many minutes have been at this? Yeah, I've got five minutes left on my timer before I have to start a new recording session. I do not wish to uh, test how much video YouTube will let me record. I don't really want more than an hour per time. I'm pretty sure I wasted a few minutes talking. It's awfully hard to think of what to talk about with the game. Oh, that's another thing you'll notice. The uh, soundtrack to this game is actually pretty nice too. In fact, if I save, I should be able to kick in the recording for today. And then go progress fully down the uh, undead hellhole later. Just head back to the city and, and save. Oh, and I can level up too. Okay. Resistance, if I recall. It's poison resist. Okay. Dex, int, resist. Strength. Strength. Int, 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 dex, dex. defense as it is. Dex, speed, int, resist. Mm. Yeah, I'll leave defense as it is for the moment, and I'll up my dex again. So I should have higher mana. Finish leveling. City means rest. Save, return, and then just go forth and check how much money I have. Ah, <laughs> shall we sleep? 
trying to sleep. There's something member mentioned about half sleep before. Yeah, I still gotta make more cash for that. Because what's the beg is some kind of OP weapon. Anyway, I think I'm coming up to time. Phone's gonna go off any second. minutes 27 from the timer I set, so we're probably nearing an hour. Alright then, I'll shut down the timer, and stop recording on OBS. Now we'll get back to the, uh, undead holes later. I'm sure you all know the name of everything. I'm sure you've played this more than I have. And got further. I didn't get distracted playing Cyberpunk. Anyway. Recording should be, uh, Stopping. I recorded for about 40 something minutes, so. Yeah, that ain't so bad. See you soon, and have a nice day.